One of the great features of EverWeb is that it is very easy to extend the reach of the product using third-party software and other tools. In this video tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can use Font Awesome icons to install scalable vector icons in your website. To begin with, let's have a look at the Font Awesome website itself. The great thing about Font Awesome is that it's absolutely free to use. To start embedding icons into your website, first go to the Font Awesome's Getting Started page. Enter your email address in the box and then click on the box to the right, the Send My Font Awesome Embed Code button. You'll receive an email that contains a line of code that you'll need to copy to the clipboard so that you can embed it into EverWeb. This line of code makes all of Font Awesome's icons available throughout your website. Once you have copied the code to the clipboard, go to your EverWeb project file. Click on your website name and you'll see the site publishing settings. In the head footer code section, go to the head code section and paste the code from the clipboard in. With the embed code in place, you can now start adding font awesome icons into your web pages. I'm going to show you an example on my home page. First of all, I'm going to go to the widgets tab and drag and drop the HTML snippets widget onto my page. Now I'm going to go back to Font Awesome and go to the examples page. This page has lots of great and varied examples for you to try out, even if you have little or no HTML coding experience. In my example, I'm going to use the larger icon section. I'm going to copy all of the code in this section to the clipboard using Command plus C. Then I go back to EverWeb and paste the code into the HTML code box. To make these changes active, I press the Apply button to finish. You can see that the icons are displayed on my screen, together with their names beside each icon. If I don't want to see the icon name, I just edit the code to remove the text. In this example, FA-5X. Remember, when you make changes, press Apply to see these changes. Also in my example, I may not want to see the smaller cameras, so all I do is just delete the code that I don't want and then I click Apply again. And that's all you need to do to start using Font Awesome in EverWeb. For more information, go to the Font Awesome website at www.fontawesome.io. There's also information about Font Awesome on the W3Schools website at w3schools.com.